Tulsa police have had a busy night and morning investigating a series of armed robberies. Some of them were violent encounters. No arrests have been made yet. And two works for you reporter Jitzel Puentes live at downtown police headquarters with all the latest for us here at midday. Jitzel. Scott Lisa police tell me that three people are being interviewed right now at this location here, uh, possibly connected to one of the robberies. They say that the victim in that robbery was tied up and then assaulted. Now this happened at the Silver Creek Apartments near uh, 41st Street and Highway 169. Police say they were called around 3.30 in the morning and when they arrived, they found the victim tied up inside the apartment. He told officers that he heard a knock on the door. When he checked, a woman asked him for something to drink. Then two men walked inside armed with a handgun and a knife. Another robbery police are looking into happened just less than three miles from that complex at the Woodland Hills Apartments on 66 near Memorial. Police say the victim was in the parking lot when the suspect pistol whipped him, taking his money and his cell phone. That victim was taken to the hospital. Then at the Lakeside Apartments on 99th East Avenue, two roommates were followed to their apartment by two men who were armed with a gun, then forced their way inside the apartment, stealing cash, but not before kicking one of the victims in the head. Police say they are serious crimes and warn the public to always be on the lookout for suspicious activity. On all four of these were committed in apartment complexes where there's uh, people in and out and up all hours of the day and night. Um, we just ask that you be more aware of your surroundings. The last armed robbery Tulsa police was called to was at Riverside Drive near 61st Street around 5 this morning. Police say two suspects made the victims take off their clothes and get inside a closet before taking off with some money. Now, uh, police tell me that they don't know if these uh, robberies are connected in any way, but the latest numbers from Tulsa police uh, say that there are 310 robberies that occurred from January to May of this year compared to 388 robberies from this same time last year. So robberies are down, but the month of June has not been accounted for. Reporting in downtown Tulsa, Jitzel Puente, Two Works for You.